Earth is about to get a second moon. I have a lot of stuff to get through, so let's make this quick. Come on, Mabel, quick. Starting September 29th, Earth will get a second moon temporarily. The asteroid 2024 PT5 will come so close to Earth that it'll go into orbit for a short while, around 50 days. The asteroid, however, is very small, around the size of a school bus, so you'll need a professional level telescope to see it. Can we get a professional level telescope? We'll talk about it. And now, for the second headline, I was totally right. So I posted a video recently explaining that the astronauts stuck on the ISS were actually fine and they're living their best life. And you all dropped the comments saying that I was wrong and actually she's pregnant. Um, also she's 58. <laughs> yeah, that was a weird comment. And they're in danger. They're not in danger. They actually just released a press conference answering questions saying that they were okay, they expect stuff like this to happen all the time, they're with their friends, they're doing experiments. Butch Wilmore and Suni Williams aren't the only ones up there too. They have friends, they have a whole other crew, and they're not left with just the bare minimum. They have rockets that come deliver supplies. They're just not set up for taking humans on board, but they're working on that. As of February 2025, they'll be safely back on Earth. And now for something important. As we all know, the election is coming up very soon, but the astronauts, Butch Wilmore and Suni Williams, had requested absentee ballots. If Butch Wilmore and Suni Williams can manage to vote well in space, then you have no excuses. Unless you're under 18, like me, because no one cares about what I think. Go to vote.org if you need help. Not sponsored. <laughs> and lastly, you still have some time to submit your artwork for NASA's Space Place Europa Clipper Art Contest. The prompt being, think about Europa's icy surface. What life may lurk in the oceans below? The artwork is due October 31st. Happy drawing. And... As one final surprise, this is my submission for the Europa Clipper Art Contest. Um, I took a bit of inspiration from phytoplankton, but I also kind of made up stuff. What do you think? Be honest, NASA's seeing this. This is Maisie reporting for my NASA News of the Week. NASA, please pick me to go to space. Maisie Facts. They're brain snacks.